Hello, today we're talking about how to make a homemade barometer. Now this is a simple one that maybe a student could try, but basically what you need is a coffee can, a balloon, a straw, a ruler, and a piece of tape. Now here's how it works. First of all, take the balloon and cut it in half so that you just have the top part of the balloon. Once you've got that, take that balloon, cover the open end of the coffee can. So now you've got the coffee can, the balloon is on the open end covering it. The bottom was always sealed up. So now you have inside this coffee can air and the air is the same as it was on the outside. Now attach a straw with a piece of tape to the balloon that's on the top. Now what happens is as time goes on and the air pressure outside the can changes you'll be able to measure that as the balloon begins to move. For instance, if we have high pressure, if the pressure increases, the balloon will start to push inward because the outside pressure is changing, but inside the can, the air pressure is not. So while the balloon starts to push inward as the increased pressure on the outside acts upon it, that's going to cause the straw to tilt up. And the way you can measure that pressure change is with a ruler. And over a period of several days, mark on the ruler where the straw is. On the days where the pressure goes up, the pressure on the measurement on the ruler will be higher. On days where the pressure on the outside of the can decreases, that's going to cause the balloon to bulge because now the pressure on the inside of the can is higher. So the, as the balloon bulges upward, the straw will tilt down showing you a lower measurement of air pressure. So that's a way to make a simple barometer so which you can measure air pressure.